Well, almost all the mech pieces. Yeah, we like it. We like to roll all those mech pieces. How are you going to redesign the Wolverine? Just probably like pack lighter but more weapons on it. Get rid of the UAC-5 and probably just go to like... Yeah, just, just we need more firepower per ton. So speaking of which, I guess we can go do that now. Prepare that and let's go to the Wolvie. Wolvie, Wolvie, Wolvie. I'm just not feeling the Yak-5, I think. I'm just not feeling it. What can we give you instead? We could go LRMs, right? How many LRMs can I fit on once the Yak-5's off? LRM-20. LRM-10. Or two LRM-5s. That is LRM-30. It's like... Not really still that much firepower. Come on, battle mech. Logos is sitting inside battle mech girls for the moment. How are mechs made in the city? And it clearly can't all be loot from other destroyed mechs. So that's actually the fun part of Battletech Universe, is they're really not a lot. Um, yeah, they make them in factories, and depending on where you are in the setting's history, there are periods where- that, that's why there's lost tech, because there's just like entire- entire like lines of battle mechs that they can't make anymore, because like the factories and the specs for them are gone. Um, like, the thing we do here, this mechbane shit, is actually really custom. Like, in the lore of the game, I believe, people have said a lot. Like, this this takes a lot of know-how and, like, facilities to be able to just refit your mechs into whatever you want. Um, unless it's an Omni-mech and you're a clan or whatever the fuck. But, like, so the, the player is quite special in that sense of being able to do this in all the games, I think. Um, you know, your, your average peasant, you know, well, mech warriors, peasants aren't mech warriors, but you know what I mean. Your average person just can't really. So... Yeah, like, um, some, some mechs, they're still rolling off factory lines or bringing on new factories online and doing it. Other mechs, it's like, you know, you have the ancestral blackjack that's been, like, within my family for 300 years, you know? And we just keep it going because it's the only one we've got. But anyway, um, yeah, I only have, like, not a lot of damage. It's just not good enough. Wolverine, we need, we need more than this. Come on, battle mech. Send a torso twist, improve comms, ECM ghost effect. It's just not good enough. We just don't have enough tonnage here to make a sniper build that I believe in. So I'm gonna go for closer range, I think. Or we could go for like L lasers? What about L lasers? Why can I not put those on? Oh, because it's a head. Okay, so we can't do that. It's looking like an SRM boat to me. More SRMs, if I have them. Lots of SRM. Just build it like the Griffins, I think. Just build it just like the Griffins. We need some ammo. Which is ammo bin. 100 rounds. We're going to need two of those at least. And then we can put on some... We can put on one M laser. Or one S laser. Probably an S laser, so you can like jump jet SRM and then turn it into a um, turn it into a punch cooldown turn. We might want to go for a third turn of SRM. I don't know if it's the only real gun we have. We've got the tonnage for its spare. I think three tons of ammo here to really, really, really go. And it still leaves me with, like, spare. It still leaves me with a lot of spare here. The firepower has gone up, yes, a bit. Is the Wolverine just not a great, like, set of hard points? I don't know. Do I have a second Yak? No. I have an AC-20. You can max your armor. 
Yeah, but I'm still going to have, like, a lot of space left over. Ball move, give me the ammo with the launchers. Yeah, because it lets me dead side on the right way harder. Subject G says it's very limited in weapon tonnage. Yeah, I'm feeling that. It's because it's got such a big engine, that's why. Leg or arm mods. Yeah, I could put leg mods on for DFA, but they're weightless, actually, so not even. Oh, no, 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 no. This one isn't. Yeah, we could we could put DFA on this mech. You could like SRM and then DFA. I'm 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 game to try that. Heat sync it up. Oh yeah, of course, heat sinks. What am I fucking talking about? I, it's like I forgot heat sinks exist. I'm like mad that I've got free tonnage. What am I fucking talking about? Heat sinks. I'm stupid. Sorry. Definitely up the legs if we're going to be doing DFAs, though, either way. You could, like, just take the S-Laser out for heat sinking. It's not really going to matter much. And we just go heat sink. I would like a second heat sink, please. So that is now Firepower 144, but I feel like it's going to be better, I don't know. I don't think I need three tons, yeah. I think I can go down and like, just max up my armor. I'll take like, one off the rear here and we should be good. Put the heat sinks in the torso so they absorb crits. I have jump jets in the torso. Alright, but this should be fine, like, and then we've got, like, the, the jump jet DFAing as well. This should be just fine. But the heatsinks in the torso, so they have sort of grids, your, your left torso of all the ammo. Oh! Uh, yeah, I don't think it works like that. I think it, I think empty space crits are a thing in this, at least in the mod. I don't think you have to do that. I think. Uh, I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure. On it. I know that was a thing in vanilla though, I know it was a big thing in vanilla, I just, I think this mod fixes it, I'm not totally sure. How many space creatures in this mod? Yes, yeah, Harry, Harry himself says it, so there you go. Okay, so that's, happy with the Griffin, happy with the Griffin, happy with the Wolverine, the Hunchie's fine, I need better gunners to use these AC-20s. Firesetter, Firesetter, is there any mechs I want to build? I got my Phoenix Hawk. Which we can just ready and store. I've got another fire starter I can ready and store. Oh, is that right? Which fire starter do I like? I like uh, H, right? H. Punch one of the Hunchy. Yeah, maybe. The Hunchy actually is really slow and has a hard time getting into punch range, but it has a really fucking knockout punch, so. Yeah, like that's a 75 damage punch, right? The Griffin has 75 as well. So the Griffins could also do it. The Griffins could also take the punch mods. It's basically who can afford to like fit it on. Because how heavy is it? This is uh, half, half ton, two ton. Okay, two and a half tons for all that. Quite heavy. It's kind of harder for the Hunchback to get into range to punch, I think, because, like... Oh, it's slower, but yeah, once it gets there, it definitely fucks you up. I don't know, I'd have to take off, like, a fair bit of shit, though, to fit it on. I'd have to take off, like, a fair bit of, like, firepower. Which I don't really want to do. At least on the Griffins, I could just take off some heat sinks. But that still would hurt. You need two tons of AC-20 ammo? Probably. Mm, I don't know where to fit this punch mod onto. It's like I want a Vulcan again. It's just like a punch mech. It almost feels like... I feel like I'm taking too much firepower off these guys to put 2.5 tons of punch modding onto them. 
To how this should be fine on the Griffin. Losing the hazing just mean you cool down when you're punching the shit out of something. Yeah. Yeah. It should be fine. Yeah, I don't have a dead side anymore either. Private Sergeant says, I know I sound like a broken record at this point, but a Wolverine 6M makes a good punchy mech, the one we just started doing over here. But what is the melee on it? Is it 75 2? This, this is a 6R, not a 6M. It hasn't got support lasers. I don't know, what do you guys think? Do you think the big punch is a good idea? The big... That's gonna make your melee from 75 into 125. Do you think it's worth it? I don't think it's worth it. I think just having the heat sinks is worth it. I think just keep these until you get like an actual punching mech of like all support lasers and shit. I think we're gonna keep it like this. This I think is a decent looking lance. I think we're looking pretty good. Okay, we're gonna wait a second. Get a lance back and then we're going another mission. Okay. Retribution. Yeah, there's definitely mechs that make punching like really worthwhile. I just feel like it's taking away too much damage from all my other turns where I'm not punching, which is most of them right now. Retribution, aggressive... Oh, this is the actual assassinate. Right, I see what I did wrong now. So now we're going to go on aggressive negotiations, I guess, which is the assassinate with a little bit of salvage, or like one salvage piece. Now let's get some dollars. Chat, let's get some money. We're only going to get one piece of whatever this is, which makes me a sad. But I think it's worth it for getting the dollars here. Just the salvage. The, the, the overall salvage terms of this is not great. Um, the Wolverine's out for the moment, so we're going to bring a fire starter instead. We're going to bring the good fire starter. Jason, you're out. You, th you or you all get out. Croker's in. Uh, I want a... Cucumber to fire starter, maybe? Who do I want there? I think I'll take an Astro Corgi in the Jumpy Griffin again. I'm always taking like a secondary Griffin of a sensor lock. Uh, Jason. Maybe Jason can do the Hunchback. Actually, no. Put, put Brit in the Hunchback. And we're also going to do, I think. Cucumber in the fire setter as well. Okay, let's go. Careful, Commander. It looks like it might... No, I think we're fine. Wait, this is three and a half skill. Maybe I should have waited for the Wolverine, actually. This is going to be a really hard mission. I probably am being a little blasé about the difficulty here. To how this is, this is looking like the kind of mission where you don't want to bring the Hunchy just in case you need to outrun the enemy. Yeah, that might have been a good call, too. I kind of... I'm being blasé about the difficulty here. About the skulls. Maybe I am, chat. Maybe I am. Yeah, good content. Hex is a reminder of this disgusting sniper hunchback I made. I slapped four LBX2s in it to just pepper max at extreme range. Eventually upgraded to a Jaeger mech. That does sound fun. That's what we need. We need like a blackjack or a Jaeger mech or something. We need, a, we need like PPCs and like AC5 spam and stuff. Okay, eliminate the Capellan Diplomat and escape. Command interface initiated. What is that? That is like a trebuchet? Is that a trebuchet? That's quite small for the VIP if that's so. But there's multiple lances of enemies in the way. What 
What's up, boss? I want to get into the hills to the right. Let's go, this Lance. Looks like a prime spot for an ambush. Be careful, Commander. You don't want to get caught in a crossfire. On the move. Location confirmed. Confirmed. Contact. Roger. What are we dealing with here? Roger. The Warrior House Kamata. Okay. Ready for orders. Yes, Commander. Engaging jump jets. The way it says the Warrior House Kamata before every one of their turns is giving me big energy of like when I was like nine years old. And I played Counter-Strike, my first online multiplayer game. And I was into, like, Egyptian, like, culture at the time. So, like, my full Counter-Strike, like, screen name was, like, Ra, the Egyptian God of Destruction. Like, I think I even had a comma. <laughs> Fire and jump jet. You know, just, just, just so you know who I am. Sensors locked on. Shadows who have been around here a while, a while know then that my names then progressed into Captain Underpants and then Beagle Boy. Katoria says, oh my god, you were an adorable little wannabe, that's amazing. Yeah, I had those books, you know, the ones you like, you subscribe to them and they send you like, uh, you know, the latest issue of, you know, Egyptian magazine uh, every month and it has like a little like toy, not toy, but like little thing on the front, like, you know, for the Egyptian ones, it was like a little like statue they made. Katori says, once upon a time I went by Draco Lich, the undead dragon, so I cannot in any way mock. Hell yeah, you sound like you'd be right at home in my D&D uh, &D campaign tomorrow. So, this is pretty nice. They're half armor. That's easy as fuck when they spawn of half armor. Like, yeah, it's a grasshopper, like it's a heavy, but A, it's not the heaviest heavy. B, it's got half armor. This, this should be a slaughter. If, if they're all like that, this should be a slaughter. Standing by. It do hop though. It do got hops. Yeah, we gotta keep in mind it got hops. Yes, of course, of course. I am. Uh... Incredon says my Xbox Live name was Incredon Sniper. This was because some fuck already took Incredon the fuck. Sounds like you got sniped for your username. Yo, they have a lot of mechs. This is like a 12, 12 lance fight. Ah, why did that have to hit? What's their pilots like? This might not be a slaughter if their pilots are good like that last one. Sentinel, they have good pilots. This is gonna be the problem. They have a lot of firepower and they have good pilots. This isn't gonna be as easy as I thought. It's like a damage race. Oh, that fire center should have braced. That fire center should have braced. Damage is minor. They have so many mechs that I full reserve down and they still get the go. They have like 12 mechs. We are going to get swarmed. We are going to kill them as fast as we can and get like some tanking up front, you know? The fire center just has to like move and dodge. On it. This is going to hurt, actually. What Reverse the slope defense here, I think, is the best I can do. We just have to, like... Orders? Need something, Chief? Get up front before they all come over the hill and just start slapping them. Like, take them out as they come over the ridge, you know, one at a time. That's our only hope here. But there's a fucking lot of them. This is gonna actually be really bad. If I'm not careful. God, there's a lot of them. We're gonna keep the evasion high. 
Which is gonna be hard for the Hunchy. The Hunchy's in trouble here in this fight, I think. I'm not gonna have the evasion needed. Let's put an AC20 shot into you. Roger. Uh, Hunchy might have ended up being way the wrong choice for this. Just because no evasion. Need those jump jets. Luckily it's not taking the fire right now. What the fuck? There's so many of them all at once. I don't know if I can do this. Depending on what they are. Especially if they keep hitting me with everything. It all starts by taking out- maybe there are a lot of bug mechs. It all starts by taking out the grasshopper, right? Oh, they've impaired me. It's a phoenix hawk. Ow! Oh, fuck. I feel like I'm boned. Alright, don't be scared yet. Scare him back. Ready for orders. Receiving you. Punchy, push up. And give him some sauce. Moving to position. An enemy griffin. We gotta kill these things fucking fast, man. I copy. Better hit on the AC20. That hit something good. Pepper says, this is why being swarmed by lights is dangerous. This isn't being swarmed by lights, or being swarmed by mediums and heavies is the problem. Warning. Armor low. That's the issue here for me, actually. Fucking mediums and shit. Oh god. That's also up at least. Just be aggressive. Just get into it. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. Oh, jeez. There is too many of them. Warning. Armor low. How's it going? There is way too many of them. Oh, yes, there is. Commander? Kingdom says, you see Beagle, the key to a reverse slope defense is to kill them as they come over the slope. Yeah, that's generally the key, yeah. I'm trying this new thing where I don't kill them fast enough and I die, is my, my thing I'm trying. Target confirmed. Inflicted heavy damage. Grasshopper shouldn't last much longer. Dervish. Did I just get hit in the head twice? Everything light damage, no. Yeah, I got hit at least once. Receiving you. Okay, and fire starter come. MG starter, let's go. Let's get aggressive. Let's be aggressive. B E aggressive. Jumping. Walking in all weapons. Scored. Nice. Grasshopper's out. Yeah, this is a medium swarm. We're gonna be very raw after this battle, if we live. Nice misses. Melee, Jesus, that's a big run. Okay, Phoenix Hawk has to go next, I think. Warning. Armor low. Ouch. Ouch. Warning. 
Yeah, I only get one piece of salvage out of this mission, too. I might just have to extract. This is crazy. Warning. Damage critical. Jesus, this is crazy. That's... Oh my god. Bang. How much are you gonna pay for this? Like half a mil? It's not even paying that good. I probably just have to leave. This is fucked up. Crusader. Dervish. Gr another grasshopper. Which one is the target over there? This job is fucked. This is 12 mediums and heavies, and I have no way to like nickel and dime them. I gotta get the fuck out of here. Like, I can maybe kill this one? Not really. It's like three and a half skulls, yeah. I think the three skull we did before just rolled really easy. And this one did not. I think we should hit that. Slam that big withdraw button, gamers. I don't know. I think we're pretty fucked. I mean, we've got full armor on the rest of them still, but like... How many of them do I need to kill here to be safe? You. SRMMO in the core, okay. You, MGMO in the core. You, SRMMO in the core. Ammo in the core. Standing by. I gotta, like, get these guys to fuck off so they don't just, like, blow up my griffin, which they're gonna do anyway because they're little Ready shits. I'm gonna lose that torso on the griffin, I think, no matter what. Maybe just go for, like, a... I don't know, like, am I, am I fighting this or not? I shouldn't fight this. I, I have to run. Let, let's, let's make that clear. I should just run. Fuck this. I'm getting out of here. Fuck this. Standing by. I'm gonna try to get these guys to fuck off. Can you afford the bad faith withdrawal though? Uh, it doesn't matter. Like, I, I have to. The hunchy is gonna, as someone predicted, gonna have a lot of trouble getting out of this though. Roger. Get a precision strike so I can get the fuck away from you. This is so fucked. I'm gonna have to kill some of them on the way out, I think. Griffin. Show left torso and escape. Or try to escape. Hunchy, run! Hunchback, run! Ah! Yes, Commander. Firing jump in. That fire starters left the tank. Run, motherfuckers! Oh, wow, that stray shot is not kind. Perfect angle to stray shot the hunchy on. Firestarter tanking, go Firestarter tanking. Oh, jeez. Fucking... That heavy goes in phase five? Armor breach. Internal damage. Can you fucking not? Uh... Oh, I'm hit. I lost a weapon. This heavy goes in phase five. I love it. I don't. Commander. Well, there goes the plus MGs. Well, they were nice while they lasted.
Very skilled pilot. Yeah, the pilots are really good here. It's a problem. Yes, Commander. Keep running, hunch. Oh, we're gonna get hit up the whole fucking way. Acknowledged. Jumping! Engaging jump jets. I'd be very happy if we just escape from this. Critical hit. Critical hit. Way too much firepower for me. I hit my right torso, you fucker, apparently. Commander? That diplomat in the back wondering what's even going on. This is like some fucking Zaslon shit, man. This diplomat is very well defended. Hopefully the jump jets will get us out of here. Hopefully they don't pursue me too hard. No more punching, please. Thank god the jump jets are so good on you. The hunchy really is gonna get left behind. <laughs> oh, hunchy, 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 run, run, run. Barley says these guys clearly heard about the legendary guys looking through lances at once and planned for this. Yeah, this is, this is some shit. Let's get hit some more, that's alright. We'll take a little bit more firepower on you. Waiting for orders. Oof, only for evasion this run. Double time, let's go. Alright, get a little more bang for our buck out of our evasion here by reserving down. Because now we can turn it up. Oh, now we can go, okay, left torso. We're here. Everything back. Run little man. Run little hunchback man. Ow, 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 ow. Oh fuck. You hitting my Internals already? No, not already. Oh, hunchback, no. Spread that fire around a little bit. Thank you, SWF. Ah, uh, there goes the right side. I think he has to be after supporting the what least racist tactical met gaming streamer. Stream. In the bold category. The Hunchy can't jump jet away like the others. It's the- oh fuck. Really hard part here too. Like the Hunchy is just like stuck doing what the Hunchy do, you know? Like it can't turn away from all this incoming bullshit. I'm gonna have the Vigilance on it, I think. Can't go in the water because that makes me too slow. Aye, aye. Yeah, drawing fire on the Griffins is good right now. The Hunchback cannot take it. Good to go. Because the Hunchback cannot take it. This Griffin got to take it either. This Griffin's just getting the fuck out. Like Sia. Nothing personal but Sia. Systems holding. What's your build slink for a long range hunchy? Tell me about it. I could use some long range on this thing. 
Though it likes to punch too. Ready for orders. Fire setter. I know the Griffin's getting hit hard, but that's better than the Hunchy getting hit hard here. In that sense, I'm probably gonna bring the fire setter over too and like mm, I just wanna keep the fire setter like in range to help tank. No, jump jet, you fool, jump jet. Here we go. That shot got past my armor. Okay, now it's time to jump again. And the hunch will take the rest. Take much more of this. No, you really can't. Oh no! That torso is not gonna last. And she's dead, Hunchy. I think might maybe make it out, but that torso is not gonna last. Waiting for order. Fucking run, motherfucker. Oh god, I can't. I can't get away. <laughs> the hunchback is so fucking slow! Eject, it feels so cheesy. It feels so cheesy to just like eject everyone. You lose the mech. Do you lose the mech if you eject on a withdraw? I don't know. I don't know how that works. I'm gonna have the vigilance again, yeah. Okay, we can at least twist to the left side now as we juke and jive. Roger. Gotta break loss, man. Gotta break loss. Stay away from me. Holding for a tactical advantage. Come on, Hunchy, you can make it up the hill. Apparently, it's a chance to lose the mech. Okay, then yeah, we don't want that. Who the fuck is steaming me? Sexy Randy. <laughs> oh, there's still a little firepower coming in. Receiving you. Jumping. Come on, Hunchy. Light damage. Holding firm. <coughs> <coughs> Ow, motherfucker! Mech without jump jets, not even once. Oh, my leg. I don't need to go any slower, man, please. I'm getting my ass kicked. I might have to eject at this rate. If I just got a lot slower. Commander. Ugh. I can do it, I can escape. I can get out of there. Yeah, I can get out of there. My rear armor, my rear armor is actually better than my front armor right now. You're gonna lose that torso, just just lose that. But then you then you fucking core goes. You could just show them your ass, but then Hmm. I think just sprint like this. 
confirmed. We gotta cover. Orders. I need you to come body block, I think. Left torso is this one. Standing by. Left torso. Left arm. You probably gotta like weave back in there and, and tank a bit for them as well. Like distract them over to here or something. Roger. Come on, Hunchy, you can make it. Get up that hill. Run up that hill. We're not gonna leave you behind. Corgi's gonna tank for you. I'm gonna hold him off. Oh, shit. I know we're potentially taking fire we didn't have to, but look, they want that Hunchy. That's why I really wanted the... Oh, fuck. That's why I really wanted to draw fire of anyone else, because they want that fucking hunchy. No more, please. Oh, God. Oh, God, now you got to live this turn. Fucking run, motherfucker! <laughs> Ejector death. No, I can make it! I can fucking make it! I can make it! I can get out of here! I'm just gonna go this way now. I just gotta, I just gotta like sprint up here. I can make it. I can make it. Run, Hunchy, run. On it. Overconfidence is the slowest thing killed. This ain't, this ain't overconfidence. I'm terrified. They've blown past my armor. I'm fucking terrified. Don't get me wrong. Ready. Body block for Hunchy. Or not, then you just stray shot, Hunchy. You gotta be careful. Awesome. Ready for orders. Standing by. Sensor lock me. I fucking dare you to sensor lock me. God, the fire setter has to stay in range because otherwise, if the hunchy gets sensor locked, it's like game over. Confirm. Please don't sensor lock the hunchy. Please don't do it. Oh god. Oh god! They've got diplomatic immunity! Internal structure damage. Okay. Hunchback, run! You're so close! You can make it! You're so close! Come on! You've almost made it! We're gonna get you out of here, Hunchback! Come on! Come on!
Why the fuck does it go three three hexes on a sprint? God damn it! Yes, Commander. We're gonna jump you out of there. Acknowledged. Reserving action. Fire set has got to move. Sling says the assassination mission turned out to be an escort mission, and the escort mission. I'm here. And the, and the escort mission turned out to be an assassination mission. <laughs> we got some crazy shit, is what's going on here. Fuck, that one gets to move too. That Phoenix Hawk's gonna get me in the ass. Oh, that's dangerous, man. That's too dangerous. You gotta, like. You gotta, like, come, like. Distract them. For real. On guard, you gotta. That's left side. Let's go. You gotta distract him. Oh, I had to move the fire starter. What am I doing? I'm taking heavy hits, Commander. Standing by. Okay, come on. We're getting out of here. We're gonna survive. They've got a no! Enemy <laughs> Oh my god, it's all missing! Please! Please let me get out of here! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! You're gonna make me. Oh, fuck! Run, run! Run, run, run! Uh, uh, uh. Come here and show your left, I guess. Like, how does this work? Do you have to be, like, clicking on that there, maybe? Double time. Let's go. I'm in the evac zone with you. Come on, the rest of you need to get out. Come on, let's go. All birds, bring it in! It's like the fucking galactic episodes where they're all doing, like, the crash landings into the bays. Ready for order. Three. Oh my god, I think we did it. Engaging jump jet. <laughs> Damn. Get me the fuck out of here. <laughs> that was close. That, that right there is also why I really like enabling the you actually have to get to an evac zone with draws. Because it, otherwise that mission is just like, I realize I've bitten off more than I chew, I just click a button and then I teleport away. You lose 20 rep! Eat shit! We're deeply disappointed in your performance, Command. Your efforts on the battlefield were those of a raw cadet. 20 rep! For that? Ouch, because we didn't get the objective. But... We got out with everyone alive and we didn't lose too much. I got a grasshopper piece though, so eat shit. How about you suck my dick, Free Wills League? Yeah, okay, so three and a half skulls I think might be a bit rough for us at this point still. Or maybe that was just a really bad roll in it. That was a victory to get out alive at that point. Hunchback was slow because he was carrying the grasshopper piece. <laughs> yeah. That's right. Harry's his bad role eat house unit. Yeah, I thought so. I'm cool. And says, win or loss, I'd escape every engine of my sea. Very well done, That was scary, yeah. It was scary stuff. I love evacs like that. That's why every, every game should have like an actual evac system. I love that. Alright, repairs. We need our machine guns and M lasers back. God damn. 
Don't put the critty ones on this one. Uh, one M laser. And here's MGs. These fire starters have a really hard time, like, with MGs, I think, at this point. Like, it's really for light bullying more than this reading heavy. You, I guess you gotta do, like, the initiative stuff. You gotta do the initiative cheese. Boom, boom. Is that it? MG laser. MG, MG, MG laser, MG ammo. I need the ammo. I need there you go. Fix that shit up. Right. I'll get it in the schedule. Alright. Hunchy also in big pain. Help me, Commander. I hurt. Commander, it hurts. Do you want to make the same hunchy again? I don't know. I don't know what I want to do with a hunchy. LRM boat hunchy is what I'm going to do instead. LRM 40 hunchy. I don't think this hunchy can fucking hack it against a situation like that again. I don't know, like, maybe Hunchy just doesn't fit my lance. Maybe I just shouldn't even have it running right now. Maybe I should just store it. Usually I'm, like, all about the AC-20 shit, but this lance is, like, not that lance. Maybe we store it. I don't know. It's that or it's an LRM boat. Maybe just ready it as an LRM boat, and then we have the option. But unless you're gonna bully lights of it, I really don't need any help bullying lights. Okay, LRM-20, LRM-20, take off the lasers. How many missiles? Do you have two slots? Okay. And then just give me ammo. That's it, chief. Ammo me up! LRM-40. Hunchback Missile Boat. What have I become? What have I become? My sweetest friend. Oh. Yeah, the right was just a bomb. <laughs> I mean, LRM-40 LRM isn't bad. For a medium. That's decent firepower. If we're being real. I need a new heatsink here. Log and no. Shouldn't be too hard. Okay. Rough stuff up in this motherfucker. Let's get these two griffins ready to go immediately. Um, and then probably the Wolverine and the Hunchback. Okay. I need to win a mission after that because I'm gonna go questions? broke. No, gotta, gotta, gotta go, Darius. I'll see ya. Need a lot more ammo for that hunchy. Wait, did I, did I only put one in? Hang on, I I, I brain. Did I only put one LRM ammo in? Oh yeah, I need like another ton at least. Probably three tons of a long range boat. It's gonna be hard. I'm gonna just strip a lot of armor off, but you can do that on the LRM boat. Alright, so now we have Retribution and Lost Air. De battle in the desert and recovery in the jungle. This is against pirates. I could go with like a win right now. Am I going to get given 9 rep for this? Oh, I didn't lose as much as I thought then. Yeah, okay. I didn't lose as much as I thought then. That's not bad. Chunk might have Predator. Let's not go fight Capellans. I'm scared now. Let's fight the pirates first and get some money. Get a win. I need dollars. Let's uh, let's go in the middle. Let's go. Mm, yeah, let's go in the middle. Let's go 474 and two salvage. I think probably the way to go. 
Um, I'd probably leave this for next weekend, actually. I don't know, what do you guys think? You guys want to see, like, one more? I, I kind of got shit to do before tomorrow, though. I gotta get ready for D&D. So maybe I'll call it a day now, because I gotta get ready for D&D tomorrow. I'll, I'm gonna be... I'm, I'm gonna be... I, I should be responsible and, and stop now and get ready for D&D for tomorrow. I need to prep. I should be responsible. I want to do like one more, especially because we just retreated, but I, I feel like we sh I feel like I should. What's the job? It's just a battle. We'll do one more quickly. I'm going to try to do it quickly. We need one more. I can tell we need one more. Wolverine is done in four days. Hunchback in ten. At least get the Wolverine ready, I think. And you can do like da 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 and even like a coil or a fire starter. Trebucket, unsubscribe. Oh wait, like I don't get to hear from you at all anymore? Oh shit. No, no, I want you back. I just didn't want to, I just didn't want I just didn't want targeting info for that. Shit. Fuck. Please, I didn't want to unsubscribe to Locust Facts that hard. See you in 3049, yep. See you in 3049. Wolverine, and then let's go Firestarter. Chevin Griffin. Blinky. Subject. Hmm, Blink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. S Jason. Subject G and Jason. Okay. Let's do it. Let's try it anyway. Let's do it. Let's try it. Let's do it. Ruby has weapons? Yeah, doesn't it? I redid it into a close range. God, if I get on this fucking mission and it's got no weapons on it. <laughs> no, I did! I, I turned it into a close range! I'm playing a little bit fast, but I'm sure I did. I'm sure it's got guns. We re equipped the Wolvie, it's fine. The Wolvie's like the Griffins. It's SRM'd up, it's all quirked up. The Wolverine's gonna be worse at jump jetting it than the um than the Griffins, but the Wolverine has the option of running as well, so. Okay, we're just gonna battle some pirates. That's it. We're gonna make up for that loss. Oh yeah, Wolvie has DFA, that's right. I'm here. Moving to position. Coordinates. Let's do it. Move order received. Aye, aye. Hold it. Gonna camp here until I see an opening. What's up, box? Good to go. Receiving you. Vulcan, and that looked big, whatever that was, but the Vulcan's kind of scary. Already, I don't like Vulcans. Okay, there's more out there. We know that for sure. Hey. Because they're... Still not even moving yet. Okay. Ready for orders. Engaging jump jet. Yep. Sensor trace. On Looks my left. Like enemy reinforcements. Okay, don't love that. Don't love that. Yo, this map is really big, huh? What the fuck? Where's the edge? Damn, this map is huge. Maybe I should go around the left. It's Crusader in close. Vulcan on the right. 
I could just go on like a giga flank on the left. We'll see. Ouch. Little Vulcan. Scary little Vulcan. Classic Phoenix Hawk shenanigans. I'm showing minor damage. They got the double up on me pretty nice here. Damage is minor, Commander. Probably want to go like hard to the right. Because I'm seeing just these two enemy units. So just go like hard to the right here and slap them all from the side. The Vulcan has no evasion. Just smack him from the side, I think, is the big gamer game here. This is in the torsos. Okay. Oop. Start with the Vulcan. Huh? They still have turns? Oh, shit. Can't even see them on the tracker. They're way out of range. Dad, they're well out of range. What? No. That's fine. I'll take the 51s from over here. Engaging. Jump. Die. Oh. There's some long-range bullshit over there I want to get away from. Waiting for I am not loving it. Dot 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 no. Oh fuck, it is a Lance of 40. Everyone's just really far away. Kind of annoying, but if I kill the Vulcan and then hop up, I can go get that. Ready for orders. Okay, Bazingo. Here we go. Look at the left torso, so that's good. Scored a critical hit. And there, they're not happy. We should be able to, we should be able to get them uh, soon. At the start of next turn, hopefully, as we keep jumping right. Systems holding. Another M20. Maybe a heavy up there. What? Oh, interesting choice. From the Phoenix Hawk there, going for the... Big old melee. I'm gonna shoot you in the ass next, but first... I feel like first Vulcan. Good to go. Mm, I'm kinda like pincered in a way that makes it hard for me to take advantage of that ass hit. Because of because of this fucker up here, it's kind of a problem. Let's go you to here. Let's just work on the Vulcan first. Didn't expect that. Good. Got rid of them. Standing by. Receiving you. Got 
Can you reserve down? I'm gonna let Roger the others that. go first. Standing I'm gonna try and take advantage of the bot. Of the booty booty. Waiting for the right move. Standing by. I really cannot afford to show my left torso on you, so you can't do it no matter what, basically. I could just not go for the bot. Like, it's 25 there. Oh, it's so much easier. It's so much easier to hit, goddamn. Ready for orders. It's like annoyingly free. I just don't think you can do it though, like safely. I just don't think you can do it. You, you, you can't do it. I'm just gonna strip some evasion off you. But I can't take that. I'm too like surrounded by enemies on all sides. It won't work. Too much long range firepower coming in from everywhere. Now, the Wolverine, though, I think can do it, because the Wolverine has a really big torso twist. But the evasion is still really high, unfortunately. Orders. I'm gonna need to do like this. But that thing's gonna fuck me if I do that. Yes, Commander. I don't want to get fucked. We'll do it like this. We'll go a little bit in the middle. Putting one in the back. Ripsy says you don't wear a helmet that looks like a septic tank. Uh, ah! Sorry, Commander. Holy shit, am I dead? Well, the face I'll cut in if you're worried about safety. I just got AC2 to the head. Commander. Fuck my life. God damn. On my way. That's why you wear the helmet, yeah. I don't like how this is going. Same. Kintaro, no quick draw. Okay, my turn. Firestarter, I am scared for you. For you! Good to go. I'm gonna jump you back in now and I'm gonna get onto this shit. Cause goddamn, that was scary. If I do it from here, do you have rear shots on me? I don't think so. Maybe. I think the four evasion without is probably better. Firing jump jet. Locking in all Nice. Get that fucker out of there. Annoying little jumper. You have core ammo too, buddy? I bet you do. Yes, you do. Once I get the quick draw, I can body you. But the quick draw is gonna be a real problem. Right like, I, I can't do that yet. Unless. Oh no, I wait, I can actually go to here. Interesting. Ready for orders. Hmm, interesting. Yes, Commander. Hmm, okay, why don't you do that? Yeah, here we go. Because it would way overheat you as well. You can do like a little bit though. You can hit for eight damage. You can like cut to scare him. Receiving you. Standing by. Roger. Who's next? LRM Rain. Gonzo says they should just make a massively multiplayer battle tech where you just run your merc company and battle over fools uh, uh, analogous to the tabletop. Like mega mech, but like in this engine, yeah. I mean, the multiplayer in this game is really fun, I'll give you that. Receiving. Really enjoyable.
I think with you, I'm just going to like... Quickshirt probably wants to punch me. It's probably better than getting shot by you. I don't know. Um, ignores evasion though. Ready for orders. Gonna hold for a better opening, I think. Should try make make some time. Yeah, I've always kind of wanted to, but I never like bit the bullet and got into it. I bet if I just go here, you can't even kill me, even if I give you my butt. Like, what are you, what are you gonna do? Hit me through five evasion, five evasion of all your M lasers and SRM and LRM? I don't think so. I bet it's not even going to be scary. I bet I can just literally do like this. It's going to be fine. Watch this. Got it. I'm not even scared of that quick draw. Oh god, the fire starter. Who I'm really scared of first, the fire starter on that 16 health head. That's scary. I'm Nice shots, idiot! My internals are taking a beating. Wait, you go in phase four? Ah! God, everyone I fight goes in such ridiculous phases. Okay, well that's not good. Reserve, you won't. Fucking bitch, you didn't. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god, please, just reserve, quick draw, reserve, quick draw, reserve. Ow! Ah, 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 ah! Okay. So that hurt a little bit, but now it's time for revenge. It wants to punch now really badly. Going behind this thing is almost bait because it wants to punch me to like cool down. You're kind of doing it a favor if you let it. In this case, probably better to just start jumping back the other way and take advantage of this stupid crusader who's exposed its uh, core ammo rear. I call it. All weapons go. Because they really want this Griffin. Standing by. Well, guess what. You don't get to have me, so say goodbye to these, Michael! I may regret this. Fuck, I haven't got any peat. Say goodbye to these! Yeah. Orders. Say. Say goodbye to these. Targeting for Oh shit. I think I hit something good. It's not happening, man. It's not happening. Copy that. Please, you, you have to. You have to kill it. Yeah, say goodbye to these, Michael! <laughs> Take that shit! That's why you never put ammo in the core. Yes. All right. Now it's annoying little gamer time over here. What you got? You've only got one long range weapon. Let's just leave the quick draw alone. It's got no jump jets and it's sitting up on a mountain. Bye, idiot. Standing by. You d dumb fucking idiot. Oh, that overheats me apparently. Shit. I'm trying to like hide my yeah. You got like an LRM ten. It's not gonna hurt me. Whatever. I'm trying to like hide my head. Acknowledged. Yes, commander. Orders. Right here. Okay, we need to like get some underheating. 
We, we need to get some underheating going. We need to cool down. We need to cool the fuck down. Yep. It's been up here. Underheat. Try finding a lake? Uh, yeah, I think I saw a lake over on the other side of the map, right? Yeah, this thing, right? We'll just go hop in this. Oh yeah, that's looking real good. Orders. I'm hungry for like some macaroni and cheese now. Yeah, it looks refreshing. I agree, Swift. Looks good. Okay, it's just a wolverine up here. Ow, bitch. And then like some little light friends. I'm showing minor damage. What's the other map? We haven't seen it yet. The quick be like, wait, come on. <laughs> Missed every missile, loser. Loser, loser, loser alert. like to shoot the Wolverine. I'm pretty bad at across my lance, honestly. They all fucking go in phase five. Phase four. Damage minimal. So it says, when you commission someone to do Twitch integration so we can scream about a chorus, sorry buddy, my next commission is for Freelancer or it's for uh, RimWorld turn-based. Can I commission you SWF to do um, freelancer Twitch integration? How about that? Next mission is for battle sex. Shut up. Shut up. I'm not the battle sex streamer. Standing by. Ready for orders. I'm here. Yes, Commander. You're not? No, I'm not. Unless that, like, gets me views, in which case, uh, maybe I am. Oh, you wanna get D DFA'd, kid? Let's get DFA'd. Not yet. Confirm. It's not DFA time yet. WHAT THE FUCK?! WHY IS THERE A LONGBOW?! Right, well, I know what I'm doing. We're bracing. We're just going for the longbow instead. Fuck it. We're jump bracing. The scourge of... The scourge of multiplayer in this game. Damage. Minimal. Right here. Roger that. We're jumping for longbow. Oh, you little fucker. That was a bad hit. Fuck off, you Ready fucker. for orders. Here we go. That's the heat sink I didn't like anyway. It wasn't even the good one. Confirmed. Stop that, Mr. Longbow. Reporting. Major armor loss. Waiting for orders. Holding for the right opportunity. Oh, I'm taking so much fire trying to get well, damage, this fucker.
Okay. Apparently I can't, like, hide on the edge here. I'm gonna show my right a bit more to my left. Rifleman, what up? Get, okay, ammo in the core. It's like some really nice fire support mechs up here in the high ground. There's like a textbook like way to fuck me this mission. It's like exactly the lance you don't want to be here. I think I'm still gonna save my heat and my weapons to get behind them though and go for big attacks. Standing by. Yeah, I'm getting slaughtered out here, man. Copy. All the evasion just isn't cutting it anymore. I have a feeling like maybe the jump from lights to mediums is the culprit. Like maybe a lights are just like that much harder to hit. So the evasion stack to the lights was like we were getting hit a lot less than now. I feel like I'm getting hit constantly now. Even of like six evasions. So I think that's probably the case of what's happening, you know? Confirmed. Is I'm trying to like Receiving you. it's harder to play like lights with the with the mediums, I guess. Let's get plus one for size, but plus one isn't that much, you know, it's only 5% to hit. I think also just meant like their pilots are just better, I don't know. I'm getting unlucky, I don't know. See what I mean? Like, how much evasion is that? Don't give a fuck. Rifleman would be like, I don't I'm give a fuck. Heavy hits, Commander. That's what I mean. It's like with that Marauder. I think the pilots are just better. They're just better pilots. Like the wasp, the one scene of mercy here. High Divine is pretty powerful. Not as powerful in Bexcom, thank god. It's not stupid like it is in BTA. Orders. But it's just taking like all my armor just to get to the fight here. It's uh, it's rough stuff. It is rough times on the ranch. Jumping. That's the big problem here. It's just getting to them is been a firing galley. It's been the best case for them. Yes, commander. You know, for their for their fire support lance. It's been the worst fucking case for me. Really only because of the jump jets that we even have a chance. Imagine this with that hunchback, right? You're fucking dead, kid. Affirmative. Waiting for orders. But now we get our revenge. So now we get to go in behind them. Probably Rifleman first. Go for that AC5 ammo there. Oh, I can land in a forest too. Nice. Engaging jump jet. Yo! It is time to launch the counter. So I'm gonna go straight, yeah, straight for the rifleman first, I think. I got full resolve. Let's just put it all into the core. We're just looking for ammo explosions here to basically turn this mission around. If I can kill the rifleman or longbow without anyone dying, you know, we're probably okay. Go away, Wasp. Go away. Longbow has beautiful changed my mind. People always ask, like, what's the hottest mech? I just need to ask people, like, what is what is on its head? My god. I just need to ask, like, every mission, like, who was, like, America's hottest mech in this mission, you know? Do you guys think it's the vote for Longbow? Who do you think? Waiting for orders. Why does Lama have three vending machines for head? UNS to be thought the exact same thing, yeah. I need you to explode, please. Giving them everything I've got. No ammo explosion, come on. Solid connection on that one. Panic level critical is good though. Ugh. I hate these guys. Right here. Yeah, me too, man. Me too. Big agreement on that. 
Jump, Jump Jets. jets. You're gonna eject. You're gonna eject. Critical hit, Commander. You're gonna eject. You're gonna fall over, you're gonna eject. Surely you're gonna eject. You fucker. I don't wanna shoot you in the front! You fucker! Ready for orders. Get back up so I can kill it in the rear. Yeah, sucked in. Commander? You think you're fucking. You think you're so smart, don't you? You think you're so fucking smart. Well, you're not! Oh, fuck you are, because then the wasp can get me. Shit! Damn, they're so smart! Okay, I gotta hide my left, right? Yep, so go like... Left torso. Okay, so go like this. And then position strike it. You're dead. <laughs> Sekondo says punch wasp in mouth. <laughs> I'm here. You mad about that wasp, huh? Me too, me too. Now it's Longbow's turn. DFA Beagle, stop edging chat. Oh, I forgot about DFA. Shit. I got full legs too, it's perfect. Good to go. It's the perfect opportunity to DFA. Copy that. He only has a 45% chance to hit though. But if I shoot my- No, I can shoot my SRMs again. I think I probably do a lot more damage. But I- But it's 140 damage DFA though, you know? But if it takes out one of the legs... Does DFA always hit the enemy legs or can it hit other parts? If it hits their legs, I don't want that because it gets rid of the rear I want to shoot. Does it always hit enemy legs or can it hit other pieces? Because if I can hit other pieces, if I can hit like... It's the top half? It should hit the top half, I agree. You can have other pieces? Hmm. What do you need? I feel like this is a bad idea, but I don't know. What do I know, you know? Good to go. Standing by. Yes, Commander. Griffin. Come over here. And what are you going to do? You have 140 damage DFA as well, but you have a leg problem, so you don't want to do that. If he saves you heat, DFA does save me heat, it's true. I think I gotta shoot. I think I gotta shoot chat. I'm sorry. Acknowledge. It's not time to DFA. Targets taken a critical hit. What does the Wolverine think of that? Cowardice, says the Wolverine. Reporting. Heavy damage. Somehow we're not that exposed yet still. I don't know how. Okay, now I need to please get you. I copy. 
turn off an M laser. Let's go. Bye bye, Alert MMO. Bye bye. Bye 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 bye. Bye 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 bye. Stupid LRM boat. You deserve it just like you deserve it in MWO. You deserve it. You deserve what just happened to you. That's what you get. I think I'm just gonna punch you. Moving to position. Fuck. Going hand to hand, I guess. Oi. I'm here. Oi. Engaging junction. Okay, gamers. I think we reserve now and see what Wolverine wants to do. Holding protect. Holding. What? You crazy wasp. You you crazy wasp. You crazy for that one, chief. Yeah, you're gonna go shoot me in the butt. I don't even give a fuck. Reporting internal damage. That's where all my armor is now. I don't give a shit. Oh, you think I'm scared? Standing by. Huh? Ready for order. You think I'm scared? Oh, I can't DFA you from behind. I'm so sad. I actually would have there. I could DFA you from the front. How hard is it going to be to yeah, get like everyone on, behind? Go. I can just get everyone behind. DFA the wasp. I might just DFA the wasp. Yeah. I want the Griffin to come behind and work on your butt. I'll try. You scared? You should be scared. Are you scared? You 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 better be scared. I bet you're real scared, Wolverine. Now. They're scared. Terrified. Critical hit, Commander. Oh, don't fall down. Don't do that. Standing by. Ready for orders. I have come to destroy you. Jumping. Hello, motherfucker! I know everything missed. Oh, but still, two lasers is enough to just, like, take a torso of a wasp anyway. Please don't shoot me in the butt, though, like... Yeah, that's cool. Cool. Good wasp. Good little wasp. Oh, boy. Heavy hit there. Ooh, master tactician there. Look out. Hey guys, remember quick draw? Oh shit! Receiving you. I think I'm lucky I've shot a bunch of that SRM ammo already. I think that was the depleted case. Yeah. That's kind of lucky for me. Um, let's jump the fuck away and not explode. Here we go. Very lucky that were. How much? Uh, oh yeah. Orders. Fire starter. Twisted fire starter. That's how the song goes. Hostile removed. Okay, then what are you gonna do, Wolverine? You gonna get up and punch me? Wait. Sure. Why not? Remember, bigger problems as DFA. No. Way. Nice miss, idiot. You fucking clown. Right here. You clown ass motherfucker. You think that's good enough to beat me? To defeat me? Not even close, baby. Enemy mech destroyed. Not even close to being good enough to best me. Where the fuck is that quick draw, yo? On my way. 
on it. Roger that. Seriously, where is the quick draw? Waiting for orders. Acknowledged. Did they just stay on that mountain the whole time, I guess? Standing by. Roger. Firing jump chat. Let's go get him. That quick draw is the player that would have been getting yelled at like in that lobby of MWO I was in yesterday. Oh, what the fuck are you doing over in H5? Oh, you fucking heavy mech? You stuck over there on the cliff in H5? Huh? The fight's over here! We're fucking dying at B2, you idiot! Good to go. Oh, nice of you to come, quick draw! That's what it would sound like. Nice of you to join the battle! They'd be, they'd be very upset. Confirm. Confirm. It's still going to rain. I think it literally is. Let's do it. No, no, it's just an idiot. It's like stuck on the edge, yeah, but it, it's also just also an idiot. Lifting off. After he says, "Wow, sounds awful." Yeah, right. Right here. Engaging. Jump. Subject G says, and then the wasp pilot brags about how it almost headshot on a fire starter. <laughs> I call me. Hi, hi. Come here. Come here, quick draw. Yeah, quickie, 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 quickie. I copy. He's charging heat and sitting on my hand. Oh shit, it can see me. What the fuck? It can see me! I would not have expected that angle, but there you go. That, oh, you got on the rock. Clever. That's okay. Receiving your you know what you have to do now, don't you? Yeah, you do. Like that beagle? That's crazy. Yeah, fuck it, I'm crazy. This better work. I missed. I I'm afraid I did miss, chat. Yes, Commander. I'm afraid I big bigly missed. Copy. Sorry, I shouldn't have missed. That was my bad. I don't know. I don't know why I chose to miss. I'm sorry, everyone. I really let everyone down. Engaging jump jet. Confirm. Oh well, I guess we'll just have to use our guns. Take that. Receiving you. Up high. Hank V Taker says someone uses Gauss a lot. <laughs> yeah, you know the sniper's pain then. Firing. Woo! I love it when both the torsos go up at once. It always looks so sick. Wolverine, we believe in you. Do it again. Yeah. Oh, you can't do it again. Wolverine, do it again. From the side this time. Let's go. Do it again, Wolverine. Yeah! I'm gonna fall over now. Scored a critical hit. Oh, hell yeah! I don't even take the injury because I won right there, because they ejected. Excellent work, Commander. That should send the appropriate message. Mission successful. Yeah! I didn't even have to fall over! How do you land on his leg from above? Um, the enemy mech was doing the stanky leg, and I hit him in the middle of it. Well, they were. Well, well, they were hitting the gritty. I, I'm just saying words. Well, that went better than the other one, but still tough. Still a tough mission. 
Enemy mech has, the enemy mech has big feet, says Hank. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The enemy has like really big size, like comical sized shoes. And my mech jumped up 90 feet into the air and then landed on top of the enemy mech's foot. And then the enemy mech clutched their foot that started glowing red and swollen and started yowling in that Tom and Jerry voice like, yow, wow, 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 and, like hopping around and then they ejected. That's right, Banzer. Woo! Exactly. Firestarter with the four kills there. Nice job, Firestarter. Who uh, almost wouldn't be still wheelers. If that was a bigger caliber autocannon, if that was uh, anything bigger, that Firestarter would not be here anymore. If that was an AC-10 or a 20, or uh, a plus variant of an AC, that was that's quite scary for Mr. Blinky there, but there for the, for the grace of uh, Nuffle goes Blinky. What do you got there for me, Barley? What's that link? Exactly, yes. Exactly. Exactly right. Plus three accuracy M laser is cute. So it was a plus one damage MG, honestly, but uh, I think we're here for the mech pieces, honestly. Got to be the longbow salvage, surely. It's funny because I actually sold a longbow piece I had before. Um, we could start with the Crusader. I really like Crusaders. I think they're good heavies. I think they're quite fun. So that's my default here. Let's see what else we can get. How much? If I if I was able to build a longbow, how many LRMs do I get? The I get to have a lot, I think. Fifty? Only fifty? That's not that many. My hunchback does that. It's stock fifty? That's a disgusting stock build. What the fuck? My hunchback has forty. Get out of here. We need LRM eighty, baby. I quite like the Wolverines, honestly, for their torso twisting, if nothing else. They're quite cool, but I think just taking the two Crusader pieces and then we only need two more pieces to build a Crusader seems like the way to go. I really like the Rifleman. I'd love to take the Rifleman, but there just isn't enough pieces. I could also take the Vulcan pieces and try to build one of them, but it's more for bullying lights and I need heavies. I need to punch up a bit more. So we'll take this. Roll the quick draw piece. I rolled the plus damage SRM, which is really nice. That's um, basically an SRM 6 right there, I think. No, I can't do math. <laughs> I can't do math, um, <laughs> but, right, but it's good. It's a lot more damage it's, it, than before. All right, not a bad set of rolls there. Ten times four, eight by six. No one can puzzle these. It's true because eight by six is six times six is thirty-six. Then another six is thirty-two forty-eight. So it's like almost the same. It's almost the same. You have the no times tables to be a streamer, by the way. Thirty-six is the highest I need to go. I know that six sixes are 36, and I know that seven sevens are 42. Wait, is that right? <laughs> no, wait, that can't be right. That's seven sixes. So I literally would know that's 49. <laughs> like I said, my upper limit is 36. I know six sixes are 36. That one's easy. You don't need to know your times tables by heart to be a streamer, folks. No big old math is not to you. I learned that math isn't for me when I was in grade 10 and decided that I didn't like learning math and then I stopped learning math and that's why math is not for me. Quickly Beagle, recite the first 20 prime numbers. Go on, what the fuck are those symbols? Bali says school made me memorize all of the times tables 12 by 12. I'm sorry that happened to you. How many digits of pi can you say Beagle? 3.14. So just somehow got into tactics games because you don't need math for tactics games. 
You don't need any math more than that in tactics games. Okay, you don't. Standing by. It literally, guys, it literally goes up to SRM 6. It doesn't go to SRM 7. It doesn't go to SRM 8. Okay, it goes to SRM 6. That's all the math I need to know. Skipper. Right. Red. Receiving. Red. Yes, Commander. Commander. Standing. Ready for orders. <laughs> Is that why you don't like LRMs? No, LRMs are easy because LRMs are in multiples of five, so that's also easy. <laughs> Ready to because they lie to you. Are you are you like ten right now? Are you like fourteen? Are you in school right now? They they're lying to you. When they say like you're gonna need math for the rest of your life, you won't. You really won't. They're lying. Listen to the funny streamer man. Don't listen to your teachers or your parents. They're lying. Unless your job specifically needs math, you don't need math. Most jobs don't. You don't need math. They're lying to you. SBS says, Beagle, you paid $800 to mow your lawn because you couldn't calculate that it was bullshit. That's not the same thing! They quote- they, I should have got a quote. I get quotes from now on. They charge me afterwards. It's not the same thing. Astro Ambulance says, I'm literally an accountant. I don't use anything more complex than basic arithmetic. That's right. They have played us for absolute fools. Order so much math, yet no real application for it. Standing by. What now? Shark Apologist says, sorry, mom. A dog on the internet wearing a bin for a hat told me to disregard all forms of education. <laughs> They're lying to you. They're lying to you. You don't need it, kids. Take it from me, the dog. The funny dog in the trash can hat. Who lives in your garbage. You don't need math. Who is lying? They are. Them. Your school lies to you. Nat Belmont says, I'm a software developer. When I need to do maths, I can just steal someone else's maths and then make a computer do it. Tell me what, what, raise your hand in chat if you need higher maths in your job. I bet there's one, I bet we're going to get one person. One single person. No way, we have a lot of programmers in chat, actually. Okay, XCOM, please, Dad. Harry. Cascade. Garfor. Zero Luck. Dr. Danger Trojan. Nobody. 5.9. Neutera. 73rd. Turtle. Barley. J5820 UAB, questions for uh, Gentle Mango, Vandal Hooch, Eglin's Worst, Banzer Shrek, Subject G, uh, Fortune Silver, Ghost Wizards. Okay. So if I was to count all of them up, that's probably like about seven people. So that's not a lot. You don't need maths, guys. You don't. There's just no need. Calculators were invented for this. So we're done today. Croker is still alive. <laughs> That's more people than slices of bread in a loaf. Still alive. Still alive. Yeah, I didn't learn to spell either. English is actually my best subject. I just don't give a fuck. Varnus says, I fucking hate it, my math teachers. You'll never be able to carry a calculator in your pocket. My ass. Yeah. Smartphones, you idiots! I just do whatever the little magic box tells me. Anyway, this was a great one. Mm. This was a great stream, everyone. We played XCOM and then we played Battletech. We talked about some really wild shit, but now it's time for Daddy to go. Um, Daddy will return tomorrow to inflict upon you Dungeons and Dragons. It's coming. It's coming. It's coming. Um, with Jamble's hot art for the characters. Uh, D&D is coming tomorrow, so... Uh, for those of you who used to watch our roleplaying in D&D streams, you know that Jamble always used to be the GM for it. This time around, I'm, I actually wanted to try to be the GM myself this time, so I'm making her be a player, uh, and I'm going to be the GM. Um, 
and and that that's that's it basically. Um, I gotta do a bit more prep, but basically overall, I'm just gonna try and uh, wing a lot of it, and that's largely because if I'm gonna keep doing this for the future as well, I need to be able to get into a rhythm of this where it doesn't take too much prep time because I get a lot of sh you know I stream the other days, I get a lot of shit on otherwise. SWS about to fucking get me again. But anyway, I have a lot of shit going on. <laughs> so I'm gonna try to like wing it a bit. Uh, I've gotten pretty good at improv in one-on-one -on -one in text. Hopefully it translates to D&D live. But the big problem is it's live versus turn-based. SWS says can't be bothered and I, I, did, I did think it though. Yeah, I, I know you thought it. Uh, you know, I understand. I can't be bothered either, SWF. But I'm glad, I'm glad we're just kind of like two boxes in a ring who've just fallen onto each other because we're too lazy to punch. Um, but anyway, so yeah, I'm going to be the GM. Um, it, the players are going to be, once again, Jamble, uh, Keon, Bolt, Bolt's partner, Birdie. Okay, there you go. And Sniffin, uh, who you should know from a couple of Dark Dark streams. And is a, ch is a chatter, so you should, you should know Sniffin from the chatting in the Discord as well. Um... Logos says, serious question, for the stream D&D game tomorrow, would you prefer the chat to press the horn or is it fun? I understand it in that in case they can get weird a lot faster than usual. Um, I would not... <laughs> I would not do that... to people you don't know ever in any context. Uh, unless you've, like, got the lay of the land and, like, you know them a bit better or, like, they're, like, sane to do it. Like... Like, if Kion's character, like, if she wants you to comment on her character being a MILF, go for it. Um, but, like, I wouldn't just do it because that's weird. This is for any stream or any environment. Don't sexualize people you don't know. Uh, <laughs> is, is a good one. You can do it to me because you know me. That's fine. I allow it and I give you consent on this stream. But that's, like, the easy rule. Uh, be be respectful tomorrow. Um, a couple of people who are playing tomorrow, I don't think have much experience role playing, especially not on stream, but much experience like in like a D and D like five man group at all. So let's be professional. Let's keep it classy tomorrow. Let's start out classy at least, and then if if the you let the players set the tone because inevitably if the players start saying things, then you can comment. <laughs> but that hopefully that's a good answer for you. Just try to be good. Just try not to be a weirdo. Um, deprived chat? You mean depraved, Hank B Tech? They're, they're deprived of being depraved. What will you doodle tuber be? Says Banzer Trick. I haven't made one for D&D tomorrow. I don't know. Like, I should just have like a face. I don't want to, I don't want to detract from their experience. It'll just be faceless tomorrow. I'm just going to put a mask on. Um, but yeah, like it's, it's, I'm looking forward to it. So it's the first time we're going to have done like on stream roleplay in a very long time. It's the first time I've ever done like on stream GMing. I've, I've always been a player. I've never been a GM on stream. I'm hoping I can keep up with the live pace, but, like, it's kind of going to be new for me. So if I kind of, like, stumble and fall a bit, I hope you guys aren't too uh, disappointed. I'm going to try to get into it. I, I think I'll probably be fine. We'll see. Um, other than that, yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited they have the gang together and do it. I think it's going to be fun. So I hope to see you guys there. Um, for I hope, I hope you all turn out and watch. Um, so it'll be the usual start time of, you know, I'm actually going to start on time, hopefully. And, Yeah. Hopefully it's going to be a good time. It's just going to be like uh, Fey Runny, d d Swords and Shields, Man Magic, Fantasy, but also just whatever the fuck I want after that. I say it's d d Fey Run as a, as a default just because it's the least work for me. It's like modding a setting rather than like coming in like we have our own settings, but I, I, I didn't want to go into doing that because it would be so much more effort because I'd have to create everything myself. Um, <laughs> Zero Lux is actually going to start on time check or remember this. Well I, well, I have to because there are players showing up. So I, I actually have to start on time because there'll be players uh, showing up. Not just you guys, you know. I can be rude to you guys apparently, but not to my other friends. So there you go. Anyway, I'm looking forward to it. So that's tomorrow. Now, for now, I'm going to thank my subs and dubs. Thank you very much to XCOM Please Dad for the 39 month sub in a row. Pimpledorf, a very, very generous tier 3 sub. For 38 months in a row. Thank you for the tier 3 sub for 38 months in a row. Pimpledorf, very kind of you. You said 38 months. One month for every year I've been alive, minus two. You just gave me deja vu because someone else posted that last time, last week, with a different thing. But yes, that, there's those quick maths again coming into play. See, see, I've got all the maths I need. 38 minus two, that's 36. Thanks, Pimpledorf, for the tier 3 sub for 38 months in a row. 
That's a $30 sub, I know that math. Dr. Ryu, 54 month sub. Xjuven, 66 month sub. Zero Luck, 80 month sub. King of the Choppers, 6 months. Pig General, 76 months. Future Cyborg, 64, 50 months. Thank you again to Evil Pink Menace for the thousand pennies. Hi, Beagle, been following you since the first Longwood campaign on YouTube. This is for Frag85. Thank you very much. Appreciate it a lot. Uh, Bad Luddite, subscribe for 26 months in a row. Uh, Dr. Danger, $10 donation. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Stay tuned for a Beagle D&D at Shavik Gans as everyone's fantasies come to life. Well, after today's stream, hopefully not everyone's fantasies in chat. Enixima, 38-month sub. Thank you again for the $10, Dr. Danger. Mogdash, give to the sub to Sinkbread. I didn't even read these. This is when you were getting me with this. Mogdash also gives it the sub to Chicken Sushi. 69 Cliche for 20 gifted subs to Mech Breed and Mech Bride. Thanks, 69 Cliche. For alerting me to the fact that those accounts exist on Twitch, apparently. Thanks so much for the gift subs, you and Mogdash. Grosswick, 33 month sub. Joko Beast, 62 month sub. Mogdash gifted the sub to Moobot for 60 months. Thank you very much, Mogdash, for the gift sub to Moobot. Thoth7 subscribed. Welcome to subscribing, Thoth7. Thoth7, Thoth7. SWF Delicious, 47 month sub. Thank you so much. Sniffin J, 70 months sub. Thank you, Sniffin. Riovial, 65 months sub. Uh, and J Foe of 820 UEB, a very generous tier 3 sub for 45 months in a row. Thank you for the very generous tier 3 sub for 45 months in a row. I appreciate it very, very much. Very kind. Big sub. Now, what do we have to do, chat? Do you guys remember what we have to do at the end of the day? If they're still on. No one's telling me. You gotta tell me who we're gonna raid. You forgot? No, I, I remembered. It's okay. We have to raid. Roll plus bond, remember? So we're going to raid this person that I forget the chatter who told us to, but the chatter told us to do it. We're raiding Roll Plus Bond, who is doing the Roll Plus Bond 4th anniversary stream. And apparently it's like a charity stream where the proceeds are going to Trans Lifeline. Uh, so there you go. Uh, they are playing tabletop RPGs. Oh, they're playing Fiasco. I know this game. I played this once. I'm sure there's some sickos in chat who like board game, role-playing game stuff, and they're going to be like, Whoa, fiasco! Like, at least one person probably going to be like, Whoa, fiasco! But I'm not going to see him because I'm out of here. I'm hungry. I'm going to raid. Bye-bye uh, for now. I'll catch you tomorrow for D&D, &D, everyone. So see ya on the dot. Um, hopefully. Bye. Uh, I enjoyed Battletech. I enjoyed XCOM. See you tomorrow for D&D. &D. Bye. Have a good one, everyone. See you there. Bye-bye. That's the wrong fucking... There it is, this one.